proudly repping the Anzacs, Australia and New Zealand. Here is City Kickboxing's UFC featherweight champion, Alexander Volkanovsky, draws rave reviews from past opponents, from his teammates. He is the ultimate competitor, and anybody who saw him compete in a rugby league setting at 214 pounds, I might add, knows just how committed this guy is to athletics and to realizing greatness in the UFC. He certainly did that against Max Holloway, but he's gonna get everybody's best shot, and that continues in earnest here tonight as they all continue to chase down the Australian champion, Volkanovski. So here he is representing the American Kickboxing Academy, the inimitable Khabib Nurmagomedov. And this guy makes his way to the Octagon DC. You run out of time setting up everything he's accomplished, but he always puts that status as an undefeated fighter and UFC champion on the line. He will do so again here tonight. The moment he walked in the AKA, you understood that there was something special about Nurmagomedov. He was a guy that was always listening. Although he spoke no English, he was always listening and paying attention to try to learn and how to improve himself. And the moment he stepped foot in the gym, he was just open to each and every lesson, and now it's showing over the course of his UFC career. He was undefeated going into the UFC, and he has only built on that and become a champion, one of the most well-rounded fighters in all of the UFC. You know, your college wrestling teammates have told me when you showed up at Oklahoma State, you didn't speak English either. No, I didn't. It was all, <laughs> it was all Southern Creole accent. It was all... It was all, hey, my boy. <laughs> right. Well, your English is now very proper, and so is Khabib's, and he's back on the proven ground here tonight, again, trying to prove himself as one of the pound-for-pound -pound greatest fighters on this UFC roster. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Herb Dean. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the MGM Grand Garden Arena in Las Vegas, it's time! Five rounds in the UFC heavyweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, holding professional record of 23 wins, one loss. He stands five feet six inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds. Alexander the Great Volkanovski. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a grappler, holding a professional record of 29 wins, no losses. He stands five feet ten inches tall, weighing in at 155 pounds. Fighting. Out of the Republic of Dagestan, Russia, Habib, the Eagle, Nurmagomedov! You've been given your instructions in the dressing room. Protect yourself at all times. Follow my instructions. We will have a clean fight. Touch gloves, let's make it official. Well, huge buzz for this fight, and round one is now underway. A class of styles in some respects between a grappler and a five-tool player type, but certainly the more well-rounded fighter has no problem engaging on the ground. No, he doesn't mind grappling, but he also has the ability to fight on the feet, something the grappler does not really feel comfortable with doing. He seems to be behind the eight ball a little bit, but let's see how he manages getting this fight to the ground. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one up? Back to the jab now, no good. And he landed the right hand there. The punch coming, it's blocked. Well, you start to really worry about the wrestling, and there's that left hand from Cubby. 
underrated. I mean, it's a very underrated part of his game, his ability to stand and strike with anybody in the UFC. Misses with that punch. Nice job to get the foot off the canvas and to the target quickly. Beautiful inside leg kick by Volkanovski. Oh, that's a nice strike. Oh, he's got it going tonight. Beautiful combination of strikes there by Nermago Meta. Oh, it's a beautiful kick right there. I don't know if you've ever been kicked by a mule. Probably feels something like that. It has to. This guy is landing his kick with so much force. Liver kick. If you take those kicks, it's going to shut your body off. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. Let's focus. Let's focus now. That shot blocked by Volkanovski. Oh, big damaging knees here to the body. Oh! Oh, straight right. 26 total strikes have landed for Alexander Volkanovsky. Punch over the top. Oh, he's feeling it now. Nice combination there by Nermago Meta. Nice nice. All right, so he continues to use his jab effectively here, DC. He gets that hit to the target pretty quickly. I mean, just right away, blasting the jab after jab after jab. He's a phenomenal boxer with a vast understanding of fighting behind an educated jab. Look at him drive his shin into his opponent's body with that body kick. Oh, nice connection by him there with the right hand. The right hand is the dominant hand, and you can see how well he throws it. Well, the champ, Volkanovski, continues to keep his opponent guessing here tonight. You lower the guard, and he goes upstairs and was able to land the right hand there. Landed that beautiful right hand. But if you start thinking leg kick, if you start thinking right hand, Alexander Volkanovski will change levels and explode his team. And when he gets his hands locked, you're going for a ride. This guy's a full-on mixed martial arts fighter. Trying to establish that jab once again. Shows him the left and then follows it up with a right. Nice one-two punch there by Nemago Meta. Oh, and he lands another leg kick there. I have an awful idea. Maybe the opponent should try to check one of these. He's got to try to check him, but he can't, John, because there's no wind-up. Yeah. There's no tell. And when he feels his opponent is getting a beat on his leg kicks, he'll just pop a jab up, get the hands up to block the face, blast the leg kick on the bottom. It's unbelievable to watch a guy that is so diverse yeah. and has such a great understanding. This fight's gonna be over. What a great way of mixing up his attack. He didn't stay the course. He mixed it up. He went high when the opponent thought he was going low. And now he's got him hurt very bad. Liver kick. Now we're just going to end the fight. Yeah. <laughs> just missed with the left there. One minute left in the round. Under a minute to go. Big call for punch land. Now he gets back to range. Finish could come here at any time. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. Decent right hook attempt, but it's no good. Oh, an educated jab there. I could watch this dude jab all day. I mean, he's so light on his feet, and when he pops that jab, it comes right back to his face. What a body kick. Beautiful strike. Yeah, he's mixing it all up. Right hand upstairs. Volkanovski's lower jaw now starting to show signs of swelling. Lands with the kick there. No pat on that foot. No shit guard. He's taking all of that kick every time he throws. The horn sounds for the end of round one. All right, so a huge round for him there. That head kick probably would have had me out for good. The guy survives to see another round. Yeah, but he'll go back to that. It landed so perfectly. He set it up great. He did a great job of mixing up the target early, going up high, and getting the desired result. That was beautiful. I don't know how he survived that knockdown. You're gonna go out there. Round two is here. Khabib Nurmagomedov right. versus Alexander Volkanovsky. And he connects with a punch there. We'll see if he can follow it up. He's landed that punch over and over again. What's he going to do to follow up? Oh, beautiful hook. Well, 
Well, you don't want to say Khabib has fallen in love with his striking. But he certainly is boxing more than he did early on in his UFC career. Now we'll see if he can follow it up. Oh, Volkanovski's strike attempt there is blocked. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. Nice. Nurmagomedov gets caught by the inside leg. Oh, he tagged him with the punch there, DC. That's an educated left hand. He's got great timing with his left hand. 94 total strikes have landed for Alexander Volkanovsky. And striking at a 45% clip tonight against Khabib Nurmagomedov. Oh, effective use of the jab by Nurmagomedov. Nice defense there. Huge block. Tags him with the left. Just misses there with the left. Oh, nice punch there by Hook. Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. And both guys really throwing with authority. Oh, and he tags him with the straight hand there. Beautifully done by Hook. And he continues to work the body here. Well, he continues to stay busy, and he continues to land with volume punches here. I mean, volume, but he's not wasting anything. He's so accurate out there. Oh, that's a nice strike there by Nurmagomedov. Yeah, Habib Nurmagomedov is not only a wrestler, he's a full-on mixed martial artist now, and it showed in that exchange. He's found his range, now he's in a rhythm, landing those nice, beautiful punches. Nice leg kick. Punch is blocked. Yeah. Pinpoint accuracy on that kick. No wind up, no tell, just a brutal kick. Volkanovski's got a big bruise starting to form on the right side of his body. Oh! He's in trouble. He's hurt. Oh, man. he might be out. Man. Back to the feet. Landing with conviction now. So a much different approach from him here in round two. Took him a while to find the range, get in his striking rhythm. He has found it here, and as a result, has really picked up the pace in round two. Really timing his shots nicely. Good tempo, very accurate, finding the range with relative ease. Yeah, he's doing a great job of really overwhelming his opponent with activity. Oh, beautiful job by him there. Maybe the opponent was expecting the straight punch, and he goes to the hook. Mike Tyson used to have some of the best hooks in boxing, and this young man tonight is throwing him with that type of intensity. Some nice back and forth action here. Try to establish that jab. That one snuck in. Nice strike. All right, so he continues to land that jab. His opponent said he was ready for it, but doesn't appear to be. You're not ready until you're in there. Oh! Oh! He's hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. Oh, big left. All right, so a nice shot there defensively to raise the guard and prevent any damage. Those hands never leave where they're supposed to be, and if you do that, most times you will block a shot that's in the Great punch. Straight punches we've seen all night. Two straight punch lands, and he's got to hurt very bad. Oh! Lands a glancing right hand upstairs. Attempts the front kick there. Nice punch, Lance. Oh, he just continues to pour it on. He has been, been aggressive all night long with his striking. Careful here to not empty the gas tank. So far, so good, though, in this round. Nermago Menoff gets caught by that straight punch. That'll get his attention. All right, round three coming up next. All right, so there's the end of the round. Two things in MMA more devastating than a head kick and nearly produced a knockout for him there. We talked to him earlier in the week, and he talked about chances to take the kicks high. He 
got a chance. He took it. He landed that kick and almost got the fight finished. Let's see if he can go and do that again. for the opponent. Well, he has certainly found the range and staying pretty busy here on the field. He's being busy, but it's also the timing. Inside, he's hooked out. He turned his entire body into that uppercut, and it landed exactly as he was hoping for. Both fighters throwing heat now. Oh! He needs to start looking for finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. you got to show up and that's exactly what he did tonight he used every bit of his skill to get the job done ladies and gentlemen referee herb dean has called a stop to this contest at 52 seconds of the third round declaring the winner by knockout alexander the great Bonamente. well there will be no shutting that smile off tonight the celebration is on as he gets a huge win by knockout tonight I gotta think there are a few better feelings in the world than walking into an octagon and candidly knocking another man out quick. Yeah, you shut a person's lights off, man. There's nothing like it. Now, I understand a lot of times we hope for the knockout, but he was never hopeful. He was sure that he...